Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. Today, we will be discussing what is Goal Seek in Excel. I hope most of the viewers will be having the basic knowledge of MS Excel and some of the fundamentals like what is page setup, etc. If not, don't worry about that. You will find the links in the description box below, which will redirect you to those tutorials. Now, before we begin, I would like to tell you guys that we have daily updates on multiple technologies. If you are a tech geek in a continuous hunt for latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now, to understand what exactly is goal setting in Excel, we will have to get into the practical mode and get started with our tutorial with the one pointer agenda that is goal seek in Excel. So, for this tutorial, we'll be considering the students database. Now let's get back to the Excel. So now we are on the Excel sheet and you can see that in this particular Excel sheet, we have some student details. We have the serial numbers, names, role numbers, class, blood group, and some subjects like math, science, computer, statistics, social, GK, and the final marks obtained, percentage and total marks, right? So let us imagine that uh, a company has come for an interview. So all these students are going to attend an interview and uh, the minimum percentage to attend the interview will be like 75%. So you can see that we have 75 here and all the students have got above 75 except for the one student which is Mike. Right. So for Mike to attend the interview, he needs 75% or above. So uh, he can make some modifications in one of these subjects, right? So there is always an exam after the exam called as improvement exam. So if you can uh, like to score some extra marks in the subjects which you have scored less so that you can make up to the percentage what you're expecting, you can do that. So here in this particular sheet, uh, Mike has six subjects, right? And in six subjects, you can see he has scored 76, 91, 45, 71, 94 and 62 so out of these he have scored less in one subject compared to all the subjects one subject is really low that is computers so what if he can give an improvement exam and increase his percentage to 75 right so that can be done so if we can do some brute force methods like we can change the marks like 55 and then check this particular one so it's getting 74 right so using the brute force method will be a little bit lengthy so you can do this because it is just a small uh, table which has least number of data and you just have one single cell to modify so that can be done in small tables but what if you had some table with hundreds of rows or thousands of rows that will be time consuming right so for that we have some inbuilt functionality in excel that is called goal seek in excel so for now let's eliminate the marks here so we have eliminated the marks and the upgraded percentage is 65 now we need the target as 75 okay so let's uh, write it as mike's target right we need mike so mike's new target as 75 okay now to make sure that we need a mark here which can get mic to 75 percentage we will use the data operation so here on the toolbar which has file home insert etc we have one other option called as data so when you click on data from toolbar you'll have this ribbon and in this ribbon, we have various options. So when you come into forecast group, we have an option called what if analysis. When you click on what if analysis, you'll have a set of options out of which we have goal seek. Now for goal seek, we need to select a table cell. That is this particular table cell that is M9. So we need the value 75 here right so what is the cell that you need to change here for that you need to select this one and select this particular cell here right and now you can select ok now you can see that excel has automatically run all the permutations and combinations and has come up with a number so that the overall percentage of mic will be 75 percent right so the expected marks that mic should be getting 
in his computer's improvement exam should be equal to 56 or greater than 56 to get the final target as 75 so that he can attend the company's interview. So this is how we use goal set or goal seek in Excel. So with that, we have come to an end of this particular tutorial. If you have any queries regarding this particular tutorial, you can always reach us in the comment section below and our team of experts will be happy to resolve all your queries. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.